the number of apps in Google Play Store has grown to around 3.5 million by January 2018. There are multiple apps with the same functionalities, so instead of trying all of them, we have saved you some time by compiling this list of 9 unique Android apps. These are also some of the most useful Android apps that you should have on your device in 2018. Excited? So let's get started. Navigation gestures are all the rage these days. Everyone has them, Apple, OnePlus, Xiaomi, Huawei and now Google in Android P. Everyone does them differently too. And if you want that too on your devices, then this app brings the customizable gesture control on any Android device for those users who are looking to get into gesture navigation or are looking for an alternative to existing options. Unlike other similar app on the Play Store, this app can do something that no other app can completely hide the stock software navigation bar, lending to a truly full screen experience which is especially nice on phones with tall displays. If you have ever wanted to share simple links or smaller files without going through the hassle of turning on Wi-Fi or Bluetooth, well, Redon has you covered. The app uses phones, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth and ultrasound signal to let you easily share link or smaller data. While it does turn on Bluetooth, it does not bother you with the prompt. You can just hit the share button anywhere on Android and from the share option select beam with red on after which the app will start beaming the link to other devices with red on installed. The recipients will simply have to open red on on their phones and the shared link or files will be automatically opened. Stitch it The popular screenshot tool from iOS recently arrived on Android with much fanfare. As the name suggests, the app lets you stitch multiple screenshots for a better sharing experience. It especially comes in handy when there are screenshots of conversation as you can use the app's transparent overlay crop tool to stitch them together to make them look uniform. The app also lets you edit your private info from screenshot or even highlight a part of the screenshot. Next up we have Torchy. There are numerous occasions like a power cut or when we are traveling to a remote area when we use our smartphone as a torch. However, activating torch on our smartphones isn't as simple as one might expect. You either have to switch it on via quick settings from the notifications shade or install a dedicated app which bring a shortcut to home screen. To fix things up, the cool new Torchy app lets you activate flashlight by pressing the volume buttons. Also if your smartphone does not happen to have a flash, it will activate the screen flash. The open source app also prevents activating the torch when it's in your pocket. Overall, it's a pretty handy app that you should install and the good news is, it works like a charm even on non-rooted devices. Google Lens is now available on most of the Android devices, which means now you can have this cool feature too. The app uses your smartphone's camera and identify what it sees using AI, offering up more information when available like details on the landmark you are looking at. Using the app feels a bit futuristic and it can prove yourself in many situations when you want more information on restaurants, drink recipes, tourist attraction, clothes and decor shopping and more. Hermit is a unique app that lets you create desktop shortcuts to your favorite websites. This helps eliminate rogue apps draining your battery, free up storage space and helps simplify permission requests for other apps. I started using this app as a way to free myself from hassle of the official Facebook app. It was always running in the background draining my battery even further. Hermit creates bookmarks and save them to your home screen. There are lots of pre-made bookmarks such as Facebook, Instagram, Time and more that comes with icons that looks like a full app. But not all apps have an icon for them, instead you get the generic Hermit icon. However, you can always change the icon with the numerous icon packs available in the Play Store. Consistency is the key to developing good habits. Regardless of whether you are trying to develop a new healthy living practice or just want to add a new task to your daily routine, Habit Hub aims to help with regular reminders, categorizable habit goals, notes, reminders, and a calendar for visualizing your habit streaks. You can track your reminders with widgets, log progress on your Android Wear smartwatch, and graph out your progress. Next up, we have Headspace. Instead of distracting you all the time and making you anxious, your phone can actually help you relax. Headspace is among the best at this, walking you through the process of meditation even if you are a skeptical or a total newbie. You can upgrade within the app to extra packages if you want to go deeper into the world of cleaning out your head. 
The navigation bar featuring the back, home and multitasking keys on Android can be quite blend when you compare it to the other element of Android and this is where nav bar comes in handy. The app lets you add widgets, color and more to Android navigation bar. You can even set the navigation bar to have color to match an app. There is also an option to set a custom picture on the bar but that requires you to get the premium version of the app. We have already talked at length on different ways to customize the navigation bar and navbar is arguably the best solution for non-rooted devices. So which of the above app you like the most? Do you know of any other app that can help you level up your Android experience? Share your thoughts with us in the comment section down below. And for more future videos like this, do consider subscribing and hit the bell icon so that you never miss any future video from Extreme Droid. So this is Samir signing off and I'll see you guys in my next one.